You'll see all the bones in the front yard. See what I mean? Um. Uh. Uh. What? Someone just walked out of the lighthouse. What? Oh, shit. So where did they go? I think he went inside. Oh, no. Yeah. I think I just saw him. Oh, fuck. I think he's... A Was I seeing things? Okay. Was I seeing things? No, he's there. He knows I'm here. Mm. Who is that? Oh, fuck. He wasn't there before. Yeah, he wasn't. Who the fuck is that? I'm going to go down there. Here. Be careful. I will. Hmm. How long were you staring for? For a while. Hmm. Is there anything I can help you with? Yeah. I have a couple questions. I'm here to answer. Given a little bit of information about a certain entity, you wouldn't happen to know anything about that. A certain entity? Yeah. I, I sure do know a little bit about those. Is there a specific one you're looking for? Death. When you came to the right place, how may I help you? So you're Death himself. Hmm. What are you doing here exactly? This is my home for the time being. I see. Huh. Where exactly, or who from, did you hear that I was at this place? 
Demi Black. Hmm. And what has Miss Black told you about me? She basically says that you are death or quote unquote the puppet of death himself. Didn't give me much information, but told me it led to the lighthouse. So I came here to do digging. I didn't expect to actually meet death in person. She thinks me a puppet. Or the rest of you. She doesn't know whether or not you're death or not. Mm. But she says that you are dangerous. I see. And what have you yourself <clears throat> come to conclude? I have no conclusions just yet. I just met you. You may be wondering why a cop is literally asking an, an advice from a criminal, let alone help. Yes, well, I'm afraid the government entities do not matter much when it comes in terms of death. There's nothing they can do to stop it seems about it right just because i agree to help doesn't mean necessarily i want to help i see why exactly have you came here you've spoken about because i wanted making... to i wanted to meet the actual person the actual death himself See person. what his goals are, or their goals, considering you're saying you are death. Hmm. There is only one goal, I'm afraid, and that is quite obvious. The flower. What does it represent? A timer. Timer. The flower dies. I come to collect what is due from the people in that house. Wait. Pez? Yes. What does he have that you're going to take? I don't understand. There is something terrible that resides within Mr. Speedwagon. I plan on having it back. Huh. This has gotten very, very interesting. Not gonna lie. You know the reason why Demi Black asked me for help, don't you? I have an idea, though. From what I gather, you are asking questions she knows the answers to already. I think. Pretty much. Because why else would she enlist someone to try to subdue death? Unless if they were of the same playing field. You're not very good at poker, are you? No, not. But there's a difference between you and I. You may be death. But in front of you stands a demon, an actual one. Hmm. 
What exactly will you do once you get whatever Pez has and you take that back? It's like letting loose a cannon with no direction. Hmm. Why Pez of all people? Frankly, in terms of everything, he doesn't really matter. Frankly, I could kill him, move on, and be done with it. But there may be something that comes out of it, so... I persist. That's very interesting. I haven't even asked your name. I'm sure you know it by now. What do you mean? You've spoken with Miss Black. Told you about who resides here, what he is doing, all of that, and she's not mentioned a name. Yeah, she didn't mention your name. Like I said, she didn't give me the greatest of information. She was very vague about it. So was Pez. Told me not to trust you. You will find very seldomly that I lie. I do not have the need to anymore. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> To answer your question, Rome, my name is Norman. Norman Bones. Nice to meet you. You as well, Mr. Lewis. Oh my god! How in the fuck? You've been set here on search for death itself, and you don't think it knows your name. Makes sense. So then you know exactly what I am then as well. To a degree. Let me ask you something. This will probably be the last question I'm going to ask you. Pez told me that the moment someone walks into those doors. To not trust an offer that is given or something along the lines of that. Don't really remember what the fuck he told me. I wonder how many people have walked through that door. Quite a few. In the past couple weeks, five or six, I am losing count. Jesus. To be fair, I don't give a fuck if a cop dies or not. It's irrelevant to me. Thank you for the follows, everyone. But to be completely honest, I am surprised I actually ran into you. I was not expecting to walk out the moment I was looking 
at Pez's front yard. I am here most of the time. I am a lot of places most of the time. My question is, is, do you actually, <sighs> this is seems because I've done this shit myself. You make contracts with people, don't you? Deals. Yes. Figured as much. What am I to do? You know she wants me to subdue you, right? I see. And do you intend on doing so? You see, that's the tricky thing. Just because I'm half demon doesn't necessarily mean it's easy to subdue death himself. That is not easy to do. You know that better than anyone. Mm. I slowly, but surely am thinking on it, but I have other ambitions that I'm more concerned of. do speak plainly I have other things that are of my concern than to try to subdue death and have you come here asking for help asking for help no I like to meet death himself and see what the fuck black was talking about Well, if it is a concern of yours, Miss Black, for the time being, is of no concern to me. <clears throat> I wonder. You said everyone in that house. Does that include... Bundy as well? <laughs> yes. I figured as much. It's only a matter of time, I guess. So he's bad enough he got shot in the eye. Mm. A stubborn man getting older by the day. Aren't we all stubborn, Norman? Unfortunately. I went uh, against my high command's own wishes to come here. They wanted me to come here with them. I came of my own accord. Hmm. Dangerous dealings, Miss Lewis. Yeah, it is. You can say I'm a little bit ambitious. I wanted to see what Black, if Black was actually telling the truth or not. She was just pulling my leg. I assure you, she is telling you the truth. As clear as day, looks like to me. Especially with all the bones in the water. Very, very classy, Norman. Mm. Lots of blood have been shed in these waters. My own at one point, when I was a man. Hmm. It 
always starts that way. The question is, is this will be my last final question. What exactly can you offer? I can offer a return from death. If that is what you're asking for. But at what cost? A life must be paid for with a life. So you're saying you can bring back someone if I kill someone. If only it were that easy, the person you would have to kill would have to be someone you know, and I mean truly know. There is an entire journey in someone's life that they live, and if you know none of it, then why should it matter? Sir, what you're saying is it could be a potential loved one or even someone you're close to. Correct. Huh. Very interesting, Norm. A life for a life. What happens if that doesn't happen? But the person who wanted that person back ends up dying themselves? Or what happens? Lighten me. The, deb the debt must be paid. Someone makes a deal. And they do not make good on their end of the deal. I come to collect. I'm not gonna lie, you almost got me. You know the fact that I have half of my humanity. I could have easily caved. <laughs> well, it is your choice. I do not force it on anyone, do I? I may coax people from time to time. But it should be noted, Mr. Lewis. God himself the devil himself everything and i mean everything dies eventually not wrong i lost two no three people recently three fellow wastelanders. Annie Quibley, Jesse Dagger, and Storm Creed. Annie to the lost, Storm to, <sighs> he got shot in the heart. Someone did a drive-by on him, he got shot. Jesse Dagger was killed by us. If I was to go through with your proposal, I would want one of them back. 
But that's something I'm going to have to think about. No rush. Do take your time. But it is certainly an option. Noted. I'll be seeing you, Norman. I have a lot to think about. Do be safe, Mr. Lewis. Likewise. 